by World News. A deadly shooting. It was all caught on camera. Authorities in Florida releasing the body cam footage. You can see it here. That shows the suspect charging police, even dragging one across the floor. ABC's Ariel Reshef joins us with more. Ariel, good morning. Good morning, Tom and Paula. Right now, authorities are investigating what may have prompted this suspect to attack those two officers. That fight leaving him dead, the fatal gunshots ringing out as at least three cameras were rolling. His family now demanding answers. This morning, three vantage points of the moments before this confrontation between Florida Sheriff's deputies and a suspect turned deadly. Back down, man! Deputy Sean Younggard responding to a disturbance. His body camera rolling as 42 year old Jean Pedro Pierre charges towards him. Stand down! The officer falling to the ground. Stand down! Tell me what is wrong here! Pierre dragging him by his leg. Let go of my leg! Let go of my leg, sir! Deputy Stephen Briggs arriving on the scene. Get your hands off him now! From his body cam, you can see the situation escalate. <laughs> This cell phone video from a neighbor watching the dramatic ordeal unfold. You're going to get yourself in bad trouble, man. Get up. Pierre eventually letting go of Officer Youngard, turning his sights on his partner. Deputy Briggs firing three shots, Pierre collapsing. Authorities defending the officer's actions. He did everything he could to save himself and to end this confrontation. I believe this is going to be viewed as a good shooting given the fact the suspect was subduing the first officer and kicking him and trying to hurt him. Pierre's family saying he didn't deserve to die. My heart, my soul is gone. I understand my, what my dad did to the officer was wrong, but to shoot my dad, it was not right. Pierre's family says he may have been suffering a mental health crisis. So far, authorities have not said whether he was armed. Both deputies have been placed on administrative leave during the investigation. Experts tell us, guys, that that investigation will likely include how much training these officers had when it comes to mental health issues. And from what we saw in your story, there are multiple cameras. Multiple in this cameras incident. may even be more that they don't know about yet. All right, Ariel, thank you. Thanks, Ariel.